What's going on everybody? Here we are. It's another week at the Home Theater Hobbies and this week we have a quick update, firmware update of my Denon AVR-X 4400H. So let's get to it. So here we are, I'm standing here in front of my TV and this week I got a firmware update for my AVR that's sitting down there. It's the Denon AVR-X 4400H. Now typically when I get firmware updates, there are performance enhancements, security enhancements, that sort of thing. And I try to go to Denon's website and try to dig into the notes to find out if there's anything else in there. And the notes aren't very good. So I usually have to depend on the screen to tell me what's in the update. And this week I got two things that I'm actually really excited about it. And I'm excited about it because I wasn't expecting it. The two things I got are Apple AirPlay 2 and Auto Low Latency Mode. So Apple AirPlay, for those of you who don't know, it is a wireless streaming protocol that allows you to send audio, video, images, that sort of thing from your compatible iPad, iPhone, Mac hardware to speakers that are compatible or a television that has an Apple TV connected to it. Apple AirPlay 2 uh, makes this just a little bit better. You get things like multi-room music, so if you have Apple AirPlay 2 compatible speakers in different rooms. You can play the same song and everything synced together, or I guess you can even play multiple songs. And it gives you a few other benefits like that, but I think that's the main headline. It also gives you the benefit of controlling an Apple HomePod if you have one or multiples of those. Now, I don't have any of those things, but I got this feature, so if I buy something in the future, I'm able to do it, so I'm happy about that. Auto low latency mode is something that gamers will know about Low latency is, or latency is basically a delay. So when you're playing a game and you push a button on the controller, you want it to instantly happen on the screen. You don't want there to be a delay, but there is, and there's a delay due to video processing and all these things. So auto low latency, which I think is an HDMI 2.1 feature, but through firmware upgrades, you can get an HDMI 2.0 receiver, which is what I have here. But anyways, what auto low latency does is it actually reduces that delay to be as close to instantaneous as possible. So if you're playing a first person shooter or something like that, you can hit the button and the character or whatever reacts almost instantaneously on your screen. Now for this to work, you don't only need an AVR, you also need a auto low latency com compatible TV, which this isn't, so it's not gonna work exactly the way it should work for me but it gives me the ability to do these things. And for me, I'm excited because I wasn't expecting either one of these things. I figured that if I wanted AirPlay 2, I was probably gonna have to buy a new receiver at some point, which to me really wasn't worth it because I don't use AirPlay that much, but I don't have to buy another one. I've already got it here. And that's one of the benefits of the Denon. For a lot of people out there, you know that I've been thinking about it. I was thinking about um, either the Denon or the Yamaha um, AV, or let's see, the Yamaha RX-A 2070, and I chose the Denon, and I chose it mainly because I thought it might get more features. And this is, again, one of the reasons. I wasn't expecting these features, but this does definitely increase the value proposition of the Denon AVRs. So I've got this now, and I'm going to hit this update button, and I'm gonna find out what happens and um, see if there's anything here other to report, but I'm really, really excited about it. So let's get to it. So there you have it. We have AirPlay 2 auto low latency mode on our AVR. I'm extremely excited about it. I wasn't expecting it, so it's like Christmas in August. So everything's good there. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment. Consider supporting us at patreon.com slash home theater hobby or use that Amazon link in the description below. All of your support gets poured right back into the channel so we can buy more products for review. Thank you guys again. We'll talk to you next time.